And the last thing I want to talk about is travel journals because I have a ton of them. I mean, really a ton. I keep journals when I'm traveling excessively, especially when I'm traveling alone. Not all of these books are fully filled. Some are half empty. Some are just the beginning of this trip and some are complete ramblings of every thought and idea I had throughout the trip. Because when you're traveling alone, you have a lot of time to think and sometimes it helps to think those things out on a piece of paper. So I like to journal while I'm traveling. But the funny thing is, I rarely look at these things ever again. I have boxes full of memorabilia and travel journals that I don't look at, but I would never throw them away. And I keep wondering, who do I keep these things for? Who do I write the journals for? Because I don't read them and I definitely don't show them to anyone else. So I'm curious to find out, what do you do? Do you also journal while traveling? Do you keep memorabilia? Do you regularly look at them? What do you do with that stuff? And yeah, why do we do that? Let's talk about travel journals. Thank you all for watching and I really hope you enjoyed this little series. Bye-bye.